Good day, YouTube fam. This is Tekken Armory, and today we are going to show you how to punish Kazuya Mishima. Please note that this was made for the demo version and may be subject to change upon the release of the game. We are going to show a variety of categories on how to punish, what to do in certain situations, and some extra tips that may help you when you fight this character. Punishable on block moves are the moves that you can block and hit the enemy before they can recover their guard. All block hit moves that are negative 10 and below are considered to be punishable on block moves. We have three types of punishable on block moves. Launch punishable on block, punish on block, standing, and punish on block while rising, also known as while standing. Launch punishable on block are the moves that you can punish using your preferred launcher since these moves are negative 15 and below on block. For low launch punishable, use a rising launcher. Whenever Kazuya ends his string with an exploding fist to the ground like this, remember that it is launch punishable. Next, we move on to punish on block, standing, or punish from neutral stance. For Nina, 14 frames to 12 frames, she can just use her 12 frame punisher. Power crushes on any character is usually neutral punishable most are negative 12. We now move on to punish on block while rising. The punishers are rising since you will be blocking their low attack. That's all for punishable on block moves for this character. We will now move on to the next category. We will show you when to parry or sidestep certain strings. For this string, you may want to use either a low parry on the third hit or a mid parry for the last hit. For this string, you can use your high mid parry on the last hit. If Kazuya flies and tries to use a laser while you are running at him, or you are kinda near him, you can sidestep and punish accordingly. We 
now move on to dodge end of string high. These are just strings that have highs at the middle or the end of the string that you can crouch to and punish accordingly. Kazuya's laser has a lightning animation. You can block or you can run at him and crouch to dodge and punish accordingly. For this one, do not use a rising launcher as your punisher as the recovery time of this move is fast. We now move on to plus moves. Most of these we cannot counter, but it's best to know these so that we avoid moving too much once we blocked. This move has a slight knockback. You can try sidestepping after this move and punish accordingly. Unless your back is on the wall, Some extra tips for you when facing this character. When you are pressured and Kazuya uses his lightning screw uppercut, always remember that it can be jabbed. The similarity between while rising 2 and down forward 2 can be quite confusing. But if you notice, there is a sound difference. Punish according to the sound he makes. Devil's form laser cannot be blocked as opposed to his human form laser. We now move on to borderline safe moves. These moves are safe for Kazuya, but he is on a great disadvantage, so always remember that this is your turn to move. You can do mix-ups from neutral or crouching, depending on your state after the attack. We now move on to on-hit moves. Of course, there are times we get hit to recognize some of the frame data when hit is important, as well as we can still do a lot of things even if the frame advantage is on the opponent. Guys, thank you so much for listening to my video. Feel free to provide feedback and suggestions to help me improve my future videos.